In this video, let's see another numerical problem which was asked in the year 1993 in a state board examination and the problem was based on differentiation of implicit function. The question says find dy by dx for e raised to the power x minus y is equal to log x upon y. As you see that the question has both involvement of exponential function and logarithmic function. So we have to deal with this problem. Let's write the heading as solution. So I write the heading as solution and my problem is such that it has exponential. Now what is the differentiation of exponential function? It is the same function itself. I know that differentiation of e raised to the power x is e raised to the power x only. So here also I write differentiating both sides because it is the question of asking you to find dy by dx. So it means differentiating with respect to x. So what is it? It is exponential here. So it is nothing but the same function has to be differentiated with respect to x and here equal to is there. Again you have to differentiate this whole thing. I write d by dx because you have to differentiate this whole thing with respect to x. So it is nothing but d by dx of log x upon y. Right? So let me write it in a bracket. Now, what is the differentiation of e raised to the power something? It is that same thing. But again, the chain rule. You started and you saw exponential. So you wrote the same function because differentiation of e raised to the power something is that thing only. But then you saw x minus y also and you saw that you needed to apply chain rules. So x minus y also needs to be differentiated. Now these are the two terms. So it will be nothing but as the differentiation of x with respect to x and then the differentiation of y with respect to x and then this side of the question means the left hand side will be dealt. Then they have equal to then it is d by dx log x upon y. What is the formula of log m upon n? It is log m minus log n. So you have to separate it. So it is basically differentiation of log m or log x minus differentiation of log y. So I have basically done two steps together so don't get, to go, don't get confused with it. It is basically what you have to differentiate the log, log x and log y both. So differentiating log x and log y both you saw that you needed to do it properly separate out both sides. Now what has to be done again? e raised to the power x minus y as it is. d by dx with respect here x is there, differentiation of x with respect to x is 1, minus this becomes dy by dx again. Here it is equal to, what is the differentiation of log x with respect to x? Nothing but 1 by x, minus what is the differentiation of log y with respect to x? 1 by y and dy by dx. Now you people know it very well why I did this. The differentiation as you saw log was there, you did it 1 by y. But then you saw, okay, it is not x but y. So when y is there, you have to differentiate with respect to x also. Wherever dy by dx is there, we can take it out as common. So it becomes dy by dx e raised to the power x minus y. And from here also dy by dx is there. So plus 1 by y equal to 1 by x is there without dy by dx. So it is 1 by x here. Then e raised to the power x minus y is there, so it becomes minus e raised to the power x minus y. Now you know what to do. dy by dx is being multiplied, let's take things to the other side. So the final answer is dy by dx is equal to 1 by x minus e raised to the power x minus y upon 1 by y plus e raised to the power x minus y. So you can always enclose it in a box. I am simply writing the heading here and the final step answer here. So that means we are basically solved the question based on implicit differentiation involving exponential and logarithmic function.